note in my previous video i guess it's last year or something i started with the rust api get post delete and we mentioned like get find all or something like that retrieving all the data from the server that we did last year and uh, getting a particular item so during that time we discuss like if you need to get a list of item we using a pagination get list of items list of items okay then what we usually do is like we'll create an endpoint like if it is a product we will create a product for the product list we will create a products endpoint and we will have some parameters request parameters like page number number of items you, you we need to retrieve number of items and yeah that's only two things we usually pass if you are in a zero page and i need 10 yeah 10 items i will pass this to and we will keep a default also so that's the way we will retrieve get list of items then we discuss about get a particular right so here i'm just using product so that's products then products we will pass a parameter i mean path variable so here i will pass an id so it will return a particular a particular item so that's another thing and today what i'm going to discuss is like if, if i need to search some item I have a lot of products here and the products will have some so when I mention products I have an individual product right so an individual product comprise of a title I mean the name name then we will have a description okay then we will have some image or something like that so if i need to search an item based on a title based on a title or description how i will do that i need to create another endpoint that's comprised of uh, all the properties of this one i need pagination also if i am searching for a particular item get product maybe i will create a search endpoint then i will pass some parameters so i am going to the next page so in that parameters what i will do so get product so that's endpoint product search then i will have some parameters pagination apply here also page number number of items okay that i will give zero zero page 10 then product search you should have some request parameters so like title title something and also I need description something okay so these are the request parameters so so it's very easy to create such a endpoint so I am just going through the theoretical aspect of this and we will see how we will implement that in a Java Spring Boot environment in my next video so for the searching purpose there are a couple of things we can do we are keeping a generic 
uh, key map here key value map and we will pass some uh, details here I'm passing title and then value is like some books or something I'm passing description I will uh, same books or something so this way key value pair a map key value we can pass that we can pass that with this one so that's the way I'm trying to implement that search endpoint so in my next video will go through the practical approach we will implement all this stuff and and we will demo also we will demo the things that we are going to do after we are completing all the necessary stuff so thank you for watching have a nice day